With rumors floating around that Halle Bailey is pregnant by her boyfriend, Daryl DDG Granberry, internet users are ticked off. And instead of denying the allegations, Halle has chosen to remain quiet, adding fuel to all the speculation. So why the hell are people up in arms about what another woman chooses to do with her life? Well, today we'll be breaking down their relationship and explain a few of the reasons why people are really upset about Halle's alleged pregnancy. Before we jump into someone else's uterus, oops, <laughs> we mean someone else's business, be sure to scoop up something to munch on at rrgsnacks.com, our online concession stand that has an assortment of beef and bacon jerky, blue raspberry licorice, and toasted corn nuts. You know we love us a good backstory, and this one begins with DDG stalking Hallie's Instagram. After seeing her post about one of his favorite 50 Cent songs, he slid into her DMs. They started chatting, and Hallie told him she was a longtime fan of his YouTube channel and his music. In January 2022, they were spotted looking cozy at an Usher concert, and they went Instagram official in March of that same year when he wished her a happy birthday. Months later, DDG stated that Hallie had changed his life for the better. During a July 2022 appearance on DJ Academics podcast, he said Hallie motivated him to be better and work harder since she was making so many moves in her career, including snagging the role of Ariel in the live-action version of The Little Mermaid. She was also working on her first solo album after branching out from making music with her sister, Chloe. Despite everything she had going on with her career, she still made time to team up with her man. In August 2022, she sang background vocals and made a steamy appearance in DDG's music video for the song, If I Want You. Months later, he seemingly dedicated his new song to her, titled In Love with a Mermaid, which was in reference to Hallie's role in the Disney movie. But as time progressed, their relationship went from being admired to people wondering if DDG was doing Hallie dirty. In February 2023, he removed all photos of Hallie from his Instagram. They also unfollowed each other on the app, which led many to believe there was trouble in paradise. He also fueled breakup rumors after tweeting, all these girls are the same. Naturally, this led many to believe that Hallie cheated on him. But if he thought he was about to turn her into the Ursula of his little storyline, he was wrong. DDG tweeting like we was gonna stick beside him against the Hallie Bailey. Like, <laughs> be for real. With the heat turned all the way up, Mr. S-E-N-S-I-T-I-V-I-T-Y -I -I <laughs> reassured fans that nobody cheated on nobody after a woman who identified herself as Hallie's sister called him out for dragging Hallie into his stunt. Daryl DDG, like, bro, what's wrong with you? Hallie's not like the ones that you've been with. You will not treat her the way that you've treated these others. I don't give a freak if y'all had issues going on. That's what you won't do. Please understand that you're not going to come to social media and try to put her on blast and insinuate or put out something to make it seem like she was doing something that was she wasn't doing. You need to pipe down and get yourself together. If y'all broke up, then you need to just unfollow and just keep it pushing. You don't have to put nothing out there like that. So about all these girls is the same. Are you dumb? Are you stupid? Okay. He re-followed Hallie after going viral, but everything that went down left a sour taste in some people's mouths. It was clear that DDG was being a stunt queen, and people were worried that he was trying to steal her shine ahead of the upcoming release of The Little Mermaid. And then that same month, his ex-girlfriend Ruby Rose tweeted that DDG was crazy for allowing Hallie to wear one of her old shirts. After the tweet blew up, Ruby tweeted, I like Hallie. DDG a weirdo though, for sure. Things got even messier when Ruby posted screenshots of alleged messages from DDG that he reportedly sent her on the same day he made the tweet about all girls being the same. In the messages, he asks Ruby if she's still in LA. And once she mentions that he's hitting her up on the same day he's going through drama with Hallie, DDG allegedly responds, LOL, you right, let me go heal first. After getting put on blast, DDG tweeted, I know it looks bad, but it ain't what it seems, swear to God. That just evil. But he wasn't done. After the Shade Room started chronicling the story, he took to the comments section to call Ruby a clout chaser. <laughs> He also said Ruby's screenshots were the results of computer-generated imagery. I know you lying. 
He also painted Ruby as an ex who still desired him and had been obsessing over him for years. Um, but wasn't he up in her DM? You know what? Never mind. Hallie finally chimed in by tweeting, The devil is working, lol. Please don't feed into the lies, especially from a third party. Stay blessed, everyone. It was at that moment that everyone knew Hallie was too far gone, child. One social media user wrote, I remember when I was this easily manipulated. <laughs> Another person added, Hallie, stand up, baby. Him going back and forth with her like this should tell you all you need to know. But did Hallie listen? Not a chance. On April 1st, 2023, DDG posted a sonogram with the caption, Can't wait to be your dad. Fans assumed the mama was Hallie, so they took to her Instagram account and blew up her comment section. About four hours later, DDG returned to the app, formerly known as Twitter, to confirm it was just a little April Fool's jokey joke. But no one was laughing. Although he's known for pulling pranks and trolling online, some people had a bad feeling that his stunt was a precursor to his desire to put a bun in Hallie's oven. By May 2023, Hallie made it clear in an interview with People magazine that she was in love with DDG. She also called her relationship a transformative experience. Hallie's internet aunties weren't trying to hear all that though. Based on DDG's actions, they believed Hallie could do a lot better, and they didn't think he deserved to be with someone like Hallie. From online forums to Instagram comment sections to YouTube breakdowns, everyone was giving their two cents about their relationship, and it wasn't always positive. Some of her fans would criticize her every time DDG was her plus one at an industry event. Some people were even begging her to drop him like a hot potato ahead of the release of The Little Mermaid, so he wouldn't have the opportunity to pull some kind of stunt beforehand to embarrass her. In a May 2023 interview with Glamour magazine, Hallie made it clear that she heard all the online chatter loud and clear. She stated that people sometimes forget that she's a real human and she has feelings too. Knowing there are so many opinions about her sometimes made it difficult for her to mentally navigate through the entertainment industry. But at the end of the day, nothing and no one was going to keep her away from her man. Child, not Hallie being out here digmatized. <laughs> Poor thing. She said that for her peace and sanity, she was going to keep her private life private moving forward. But the question is, would DDG do the same? <laughs> the Little Mermaid hit theaters in May 2023, and during the UK premiere, Hallie held hands with her co-star, Jonah Howard King, who played the role of Prince Eric. Hallie's fans went absolutely bananas over the images and encouraged Hallie to leave DDG in the dust and get her swirly swirl on. It didn't help that during other promotional appearances, Hallie and Jonah had undeniable chemistry and a sweet appreciation for each other. Someone who was noticeably quiet through it all was DDG, but he didn't keep his lips sealed for long. So DDG was caught trolling Hallie's co-star Jonah from a spam Twitter account. Now, an account with the name Aubrey Wiggins responded with, they really think this N-word got the willpower to take DDG girl? He's not him. Now, thing <laughs> is, this Aubrey Wiggins account apparently belongs to DDG. In July 2023, he released a song called Famous that explicitly confirmed what a lot of people already knew. He was jealous as hell. In the lyrics, he reveals that the hardest thing he has done is fall in love with a famous Yeah. He really referred to her as the B word. Mm, mm, mm. He also talks about how it made him upset to see her kiss her co-star in the film and also references the photo of Hallie and Jonah holding hands at the UK premiere. He also raps about wanting to leave the relationship but being too attached, and he worries about her texting her co-stars outside of work. Well, the internet lit him up and called him a failed rapper. Another online user called him an insecure small little man and a whole loser. <laughs> Dang, dog. Her fans couldn't believe he was turning her budding career into a spectacle. He addressed the backlash in a video where he stated that the song was just a song and everyone needed to relax. 
A week later, he announced he was retiring from YouTube so he could focus on making music. He got rid of all his videos, but surprise, surprise, it was all a stunt. He's back on the platform with multiple videos that have Halle plastered in the thumbnail. Halle's solo debut single, Angel, was released at the start of August. Instead of her fans focusing on her new music, the attention has shifted to allegations that she's pregnant. After she was captured in the background of a video with what appeared to be a baby bump, as well as the interesting outfit she chose to wear to Beyonce's concert, online users have been ripping into her for allegedly getting pregnant by DDG. The online vitriol got so bad, Chloe had to hop on Instagram live to tell people, and y'all better keep my sister's name out your mouth. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. You're about to get me riled the hell up. Anyways, love you. But as the days have passed by, more online users have pointed out all the reasons why Hallie might really be pregnant, including allegations that she's posting old content with a flat belly on her Instagram to throw people off. A writer at Toya's World blog wrote that if Hallie is indeed pregnant by a paranoid, immature rapper who cannot handle her flourishing career, then that's Hallie's business. However, Funky Dineva wasn't as kind. During an episode of TGIF, he started out by dragging Chloe for coming to Hallie's defense. I can officially say I don't like her. Chloe Bailey is so goddamn lame to me. You are Miss Preppy Ashley from the suburbs. Then you came out, you was being all promiscuous, and then now you're trying to be a gangster. None of it is fucking believable girl none of it is believable and i'm probably gonna catch a lot of backlash for this and without that makeup she ain't cute then he went ham on hallie and ddg funky advised hallie to stop playing in people's faces because everyone could tell that she was pregnant he also said that everyone's biggest concern is her being pregnant by a loser i don't like people playing in our face right the girl is clearly pregnant stop playing in our damn face our bestie Couture Bay chimed in on all of this hot, stankin' mess in a recent video. Funky Dineva gives me he don't like black women. He gives me he doesn't like black women. Y'all see it? Funky drags Chloe. What are you dragging Chloe for because Hallie is pregnant? He looks a mess. Where are your friends, Funky? Where is your village, Funky? You look crazy over there. Be sure to watch her full reaction in the link posted in our description box and subscribe to her channel. So the following day, Chloe took to her Twitter to write that people be so mad about other people's happiness. Hallie responded by writing, they need help immediately. Whether Hallie is pregnant or not is entirely her business. However, the consensus appears to be that people are disappointed that she would bring a child into the world with a man who has publicly disrespected her over and over again. One online user accused him of trapping her in an effort to slow down the success she's been experiencing in her career. And then a Redditor user wrote, It's giving me Kiki Palmer's baby daddy vibes, and I don't like it for her. These days, pregnancy is no longer a career killer. Although being a mom might squash any future Disney opportunities, it doesn't necessarily mean that every door in the industry will be shut for her as well. And perhaps parenthood will make DDG grow up a bit and he'll chill out with all the online antics. Or maybe this is only the beginning of a future hot stankin' mess topic for our Red Flag video playlist. If you enjoyed this video, let us know down below. And thanks for watching RRG.